I don't know what to do to make my attention span better. Like, I feel like since I've been on social media for so many years, ever since I was like, bro, I think I got on social media when I was like five years old, bro. Like, I don't even think that's legal, but YouTube, don't ban me. But like, bro, I've been on social media since I was a kid, bro, and just watching videos, watching videos, watching like Minecraft videos, all types of videos, Call of Duty. I've been on social media for so long, and I feel like so many people watching this video can relate because, I mean, it's pretty addicting, I'm not gonna lie. One little thing happened to me today that really had me thinking like, dang, bro, my attention span is really cooked. Like, earlier in my day today, I was trying to edit some youtube videos but i was really just getting distracted i was looking at like other tabs of youtube videos i was looking at the comment section i was looking at oh what's on my phone look at instagram like bro i could barely focus and my head was kind of hurting like, i don't know what was happening to me today but i could not think like i really wish i had the power to just turn on my brain and be like yo lock in six hours straight don't look at the time don't look at your phone just straight edit videos straight work straight email straight all that call people i don't know what i gotta do if you guys have any advice for me maybe i gotta start doing some meditation 10 hours a day or something like what do i gotta do to to better my attention span and even though my job technically is to be on social media and post content i don't really be on social media like that like yeah i'll be on ig here and there yeah open up tiktok sometimes but like i don't even be on social media as much as i used to be and my attention span still be like it's still be like getting some brain fog in there like i still can't be thinking straight i mean if i'm being honest bro sometimes i get out of my bed and i instantly start checking my phone checking emails i'm just like bro i know i shouldn't be checking my phone off the wake up but i'm not gonna lie bro sometimes i'll be doing that and i know i gotta stop it's kind of creepy how like my body immediately Immediately grabs my phone like it just attached to it. it's like my arm is just attached to my phone off the wake up which is bad like sometimes i'll be having to tell my brain like yo chill like stop stop why are you grabbing your phone off the wake up go wash your face go do your routine go you know what i'm saying do stuff like that and i know some of y'all watching this video have gone straight out of bed and started scrolling on tiktok for like one hour two hours okay two hours might be a little crazy but like 30 minutes of just straight scrolling and then when you get out of bed you're just like oh like you have this brain fog in your mind i'm just like we all gotta stop just ruining our attention span and i also feel like what you eat throughout the day plays a huge factor on how you feel in terms of brain fog because if you just get out of bed and you're grabbing some cheetos you're eating some chips you're eating some candy i'm just like bro your brain is gonna feel weird your body's gonna feel weird and you're not gonna be able to think like how are you gonna study for that final exam if you just ate like 10 packs of gummies you had like two bags of chips like bro you're literally cooked bro you're literally making your whole body cook and the reason why i feel like my nutrition plays such a big role in how i focus throughout the day is because sometimes i just be editing a video or like doing some type of work and then i feel like hmm i'm kind of hungry right now like i'm not even hungry i just feel like i get bored so then i eat out of boredom i know that sounds like a little crazy but sometimes i'll just be eating when i'm bored bro like you lying if you never went downstairs and then opened up your fridge knowing that there's no food in that house and you just like dang you close it you go to your cabinet open it dang then you go back to your fridge open it for snacks like you just keep doing the same cycle like i be doing that joint every single day whenever i'm bored i don't know why i do it because when i open it all i see is straight ice cubes like i don't know why my brain thinks some new food's gonna just generate into the fridge but bro i've genuinely wasted hours just checking my fridge over and over again for new snacks that don't exist like the days when i had my best mental clarity and i was able to focus for like two three hours straight like no interruptions no checking my phone is when i had the best nutrition throughout the day because i'm not gonna lie to you guys like bro there's times when like my nutrition gets super bad i mean super bad i'm gonna put up some pictures on the screen on what i've eaten just know it gets super bad bro hey bro top in if you want donuts from me man go ahead and tap in bro we got all types of donuts in here man it's going crazy, bro. Come shop. Come shop. Oh my goodness. Look at that, bro. Come shop. Hey, but don't worry, though. I'm still locking down my nutrition day by day. It's just that sometimes my mom be buying some snacks that be looking a little too scrumptious, bro. Like, I gotta take that Rice crispy. Like, do I gotta try meditation? Like, what do I gotta do? Do I gotta go on, like, some nature walks or something? Do I gotta... Maybe after I crank out, like, two, three hours of work, I just go on a nature walk outside, breathe some fresh air, or do something like that. But I don't really know. But like I was saying, the fact that you can just go on TikTok and just instantly scroll. Infinite content is just never stops, bro. It just keeps on going, keeps on going. I'm just like, it's really insane bro like social media is just getting so addicting nowadays bro and by doing this scrolling every single day we're just training our minds to being like oh what's the next shot of dopamine oh what's that what's that just this new thing like bro every single second something new something new something new new video new video it's just like bro our brains are just getting fried like i can't even imagine what it's like having tiktok at a young age because imagine being five years old having tiktok just scrolling scrolling over and over like by the time you like my age like 18 years old your brain's gonna be just mush you're gonna be walking around you're not gonna be able to pay attention in class you're gonna be i don't know 
though you might not even be a functional human like even though i'm only a teenager right now when i have kids they is not having no tiktok social media until they're like in middle school because when you're like from like the ages of zero all the way to fifth grade bro you should just be outside experiencing life having fun being at the park falling off your bike going to the pool stuff like that you should not have all this social media shit gang like it's just bad but if i'm being completely honest it's probably gonna be even harder to try to hide social media from a kid in like the year 2050 because who knows what's gonna be happening in 2050 bro there might be like flying robots flying cars or something like that who knows bro but the main point i'm trying to get at today is that we should all lower our social media just by a tiny bit we don't have to completely go on a dopamine detox like a guru cut off her hair go bald and do stuff like that but like i feel like everyone should you know what i'm saying use social media for the benefit like go on it here and there but don't be on it for hours off the wake up just insane things like that because that's when it gets out of hand but if any of you guys watching this video have any advice for me on bettering my attention span i know i'll be giving y'all advice but today your boy eddie needs some advice because bro sometimes like i just can't think straight gang like there's days where like i can think good but like i said there's days where it gets super super bad if you're new to my channel make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe and i'll probably see y'all boys uh whenever whenever i feel like posting another video again but be on the lookout follow your boy on ig if you want your videos edited go ahead and hit me up at info at hoppintech.com but yeah that's pretty much it it's your boy hoppin aka eddie and i'll see y'all boys later peace out